All right, Nikki, can we bring on our next guest here? I, I know he, he can't uh, spend very long. So we have a uh, very unique situation here, of course. Nicholas J. Tedisco, who is, you know, close to Saintum, right? I mean, you know, he people don't understand. Well, at least he thinks so. No, 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 no. He's very close to Saintum. You all know that. I mean, really, in the whole time we've We're going to find out for sure, aren't we? Well, yeah, we are going to find out. Who's but coming we, on? We, we, Nikki, Nikki gets in one dark mood per year, and, and, and that's really about it. The that's not, well, he, that was with me Tuesday. I, yeah, well, you should have heard him yeah, yelling no, at that's me. That's true, that's true. But he's very saintly. He, he's involved in everything. He's a really wonderful community guy. Of course, he's always behind the camera, never takes any credit. He does all the work here. We come out and do the big, big shtick. But somewhere along the line, Nikki obviously does a lot of work at St. Anne's Church. And, and I don't know how it actually started, right? But he was talking about, you know, the priest at St. Anne's and what he did. And somewhere along the line, we came up with, you know, Father Moran. This, this shows, shows this for shows you. for you, and and I don't know. It's kind of taken on a, a life of its own. <laughs> and and when I walked in the studio this morning, and now I happen to be at St. Mary's, the rival parish, you know, because of course we've always talked about, you know, one end of town where you guys live and poor St. Anne's and all the lake people, right? And then there's the other good end of town where St. Mary's and what you know, town did you ever see that had two Catholic churches? Two post offices, right. two supermarkets, two Legion posts, two Little League parades, two separate Little Leagues. It's a class warfare. It's because the thing, Italians yeah. always live down by the lake. That's and the, tra the traitor Italians went up the other way. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I was shocked, surprised, amazed, and, and, and stunned when I walked in the studio and, and I saw this outfit with a, a kind of black with a white collar. I think that's kind of contemporary nowadays for, for priests. Anyway, it was Father Moran, and here he is, Father Moran! <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice to have you. Good morning, Father. A pleasure, Father. What's Nikki playing in the background for you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Father, we're, we're dying to find out. So. How did you happen to start talking to Nikki about the show? Did you, you actually watch us? You can't be watching us, right? I watched it one Saturday night. Yeah? I, I couldn't believe how quiet it was. <laughs> <laughs> Billy wasn't on. So I, I mentioned it to Nick the next morning. I said, where did you get those guys? <laughs> <laughs> and I opened my big mouth and it has a stock. <laughs> So, do you still watch the show? I certainly do. do? I was telling Father O'Connell about it this morning, yep. so we'll have to get him uh, to watch. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. I think we had a reference to Father O'Connell last time. We That's actually right, devoted the show to both we of did. you. Now that now that he's <laughs> now Father O'Connell's kind of moved on. Is he, is he in yeah. semi-retirement or is he uh, still very active? Or? Um, he, he's officially, uh, retired, officially retired, but he yeah. keeps very busy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what do you do for keeping busy? Uh, are you Besides busy? watching us. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> I'm trying to recover from you. <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> are you a sports fan at all? Sure. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Who do you follow? Uh, what I can. I, you know, yep. I remember Ted Williams in 46 when they lost. The oh. Enos Slaughter You're stole a, home. Oh, my goodness. Huh? You know, well, I'm going to have stuff. to move you next to Henry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's a close affinity there, I can tell already. <laughs> yeah, 46. Do you remember the old Braves, Boston Braves? I certainly do. Yeah. Did you go? Did you go to games? Oh, oh sure. Yeah. 1948. Remember that? Wow. Yeah. Yeah. wow. So you've been around here your whole life? Or oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Oh. Absolutely. My father was a great Red Sox fan. And yeah. He imbued that to my brother and I. Wow. And so where were you born? Where, where you, Worcester. Oh, you grew up in the city? What, what area of the city? Uh, over by uh, Worcester State College. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Of course, Billy comes from uh, the hill, from, the Grafton, from hill, Grafton, yeah. hill. Grafton Hill. And I come from off of Shrewsbury Street, Street, Plantation Street. Street. My uh, grandparents and aunts were up on Grafton Hill, yeah. St. Stephen's Parish. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. So, Father, do you remember, um, I'm sorry, Billy, did you want to? Go right ahead. Do you remember Mabel, the uh, maid at the church? Were you there that uh, I, I, I remember hearing about her. Oh, my God. So you even go beyond five? He's just telling us he's been here since 1948. And you're bringing up somebody that was there before. Come on. No. Come, no. come on. I remember Mabel. I remember Mabel. Oh, hey, 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 oh, Mabel. Mabel. The only Mabel oh. I ever remember was Black Label. <laughs> Let me tell you a little story about Mabel. Yeah, all right. She was the, she took, oh, you know, she took care of the house, the rectory. Right. So Father Gornier at the time was the priest. And we'd go over there. We wanted to use the hall to play basketball. Ball. Now I'm 12, 13 years old, and we go. They'd always send me to the door. I had to go to the door all the time. Uh -huh, uh -huh. She would always answer the door. Uh -huh. So I'd say, uh, "Hi, Mabel. Uh, we want to use the gym. Is Father Garnier here?" 
Father, not here. Go home. <laughs> we know he's there. Go home. <laughs> so now, now he hears it. Father Gwan, he hears it. He's in the background. Hey, what do you guys want to do? He pushes her out of the way. He goes, come on, I'll play with you. <laughs> Go uh, so, Father, tell us a little bit what's what's going on at St. Anne's these days. Uh, what's what's the activity level? Any special things going on? Or? Well, we're just trying to get ready to, for the fall, right. things like that. Yeah. There's always plenty to do. There's no dull moments. Yeah. Not with human services and everything downstairs, you sure. know? Sure, they, Plus, you run the free clinic. The free medical clinic, yeah. That's fantastic. Thousands of people have been taken care of wow. by the free medical clinic and... Um, Human services. That's one. You know, the thrift shop downstairs. So uh, just because it's summer doesn't mean uh, there isn't life. Sure. And people come to St. Anne's because they need help. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Right? That's nice. Homeless. Yeah. yeah. Medical. Yeah. Food. Right. Clothing. That's wonderful. I've done a lot of that's weddings. With, I've done a lot of weddings with Father Murray yeah. as a photographer. Right. And he's one of the What's most, his good side? By no, the way. He, believe me, I've done weddings with a lot of priests. And yeah. He's one of the best to work for. Really? <laughs> really? Yeah. It's real easy photographing a wedding when he's the uh, celebrant. Well, Are you saying just, he's photogenic? Yeah. I hide. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying he's my run of the place. <laughs> uh, how long have you been at St. Anne's? How many years? I'm in my 17th year. So where were you before that? Uh, Lunenburg. Lunenburg. Yeah. And I was at St. Mary's before that. Oh, many, many moons. Oh, you were at St. Mary's, really? For a couple of years, yeah. Yeah. Now, who was the pastor at St. Mary's when you were there? Father Ed Lynch. Father, Lynch, Father Lynch. Father Lynch. Father yeah, Lynch. I remember him. Father Lynch, I got to tell you the truth. Father Lynch struck terror in my heart. I was a little kid. We were, uh, well, I, I went to St. <laughs> I went to St. Mary's. Uh, I was the first graduating class from St. Mary's oh School. Oh, my God. Many, many years ago. It was back in the 60s. They started the school with only three grades. Mm -hmm. And then each year, they added a different I grade. And I moved from Worcester in the seventh grade. And somehow, I survived for two years there again. You know, the Worcester well, the equivalent, Well, the equivalent of Father Lynch was yeah. Father Smith. Yeah, Father Lynch. Oh, sure. Uh, Father Lynch was, was... They were was both uh, pastors at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. We used yeah. to all stand at the back of the church during Mass. This is when I was 15, 16, 17 years old. Yeah. So we'd stand at the back, and all of a sudden, right before Mass would start, in would come Father Smith. We, we would a beeline to seats. <laughs> he didn't have to say anything. That's what I mean. Father Lynch, he had a commanding presence, let's put it that way, especially if you were a little kid. Yeah. Uh, I enjoyed him the two years I was with him. Yeah. But it was his later years, too. Yeah. Yeah. Remember the Latin? Yeah, how the mass used to be in Latin? Sure, I learned all that right. Latin to be an altar boy. You know, <laughs> and you've been been sucking up now the entire show. I love doing weddings at Father Moran's. I was an altar boy, Father Moran. <laughs> well, what do you need an extra help or what? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I mean, want to go up there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, you're on a sideways path, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Father, we really appreciate it. Anything well, I say? finally got here. You right? got here. You I got here. I finally <laughs> got here. And I enjoyed seeing you all. In the flesh. <laughs> <laughs> and there's a lot of flood. <laughs> it sure is. It sure is. Uh, Father, a pleasure having you okay. on. Thank you so much. We know you got to run. Yeah. Take it easy. <laughs> Father Moran. All right. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks, Father. Uh, Father oh, Moran. that was so special. I'll tell you, when I walked in this morning and Father Moran came, I, I wish you guys had actually. I, I, okay, here we go. Father, Father, Father Moran, wait a minute. Before you leave. Father Moran, this, this show's, show's for you. <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs>